Hello my friends, it's the Game Boy Geek here. When I sit down to play a game, it's typically just a game. But when I got my first game table and I sat down at it, had my friends around and played the same games we've been playing before, they felt different to me. It felt like an event. It felt like the game was bigger than it really was. Everything was better about the experience because of the table that we were playing at. Now today, I wanna to show you a new game table that I've got. Uh, and I wanna show it off to you because uh, there is a really special thing going on right now at this table. Uh, it is having this big group buy where you can get it 40% off. Uh, for in the, the earlier you are in the buying process, the sooner you'll get it. You'll even be able to get, them, get the table within the end of this year, 2020, if you're one of the first 100 buyers and you're getting a 40% off. It makes this table one of, if not the most affordable, full bona fide game table in the industry. Uh, and so let me show it off to you and then I'll show you all the details at the end on how you can learn more and possibly purchase one. This is the Origins Game Table. Now, it has nothing to do with the Origins Game Fair in any way, shape, or form. In fact, this is from a company called Game Theory Tables, which is an imprint of BBO Poker Tables. They've been making gaming tables for the poker industry for over 14 years, so they know what they're doing. Now, obviously, this is the black version of the table. There's other colors I'll show you in just a moment, but these are made from solid ash. Now the playing surface itself is 61 inches by 37 inches and has a four inches of recessed player area that's sunken down. So for example, if you're using a standard six panel board like Ticket to Ride, it fits with a lot of headroom around it. Now there's a lot of indentations in the table right near where you're sitting where you can place all your different tokens and pieces and things like that. In this case, I've got all the different trains for Ticket to Ride lined up. And you may have noticed there's actually eight cup holders that come with those little silver rings that you put in there. So it holds the cups nice. And this is standard in this table, getting these eight cup holders. Now the outer dimensions of the table are 72 inches long by 48 inches wide. Now this lets you sit six players very comfortably, but as you can see here, you can easily fit eight people having three chairs on each of the long sides. And even here, you can see how much room there is still in between my chairs, so you can definitely fit eight players around the table. And in case you're wondering, from the inside leg of each side, there's 61 and a half inches that you have to place chairs and people in there. Now from the floor to the bottom of the table, there's 26 inches, so you do have a lot of room, even for taller players. Well, you might be saying, well, great, it fits Ticket to Ride, but what about some of the larger games? Well, here's the scythe board set up with four players and all their player boards set there to show you that you can definitely fit, you know, people playing scythe on this table easily. Now, there are three different colors you can get this table in. This, of course, is the black, but the other two colors are a gray stone, and then there's also a mahogany. Now the playing surface itself, uh, it comes with a standard sort of graystone play mat, but you could get different colors of velveteen. Uh, you can also have your full custom layout, like you saw mine had the Game Boy Geek logo on there. They can do that for anybody. It's not just there for, you know, contributors like myself that create content. If you want to have your own logos, your own graphics on there, they can do that for you too. Now, as you saw, this table was just the playing surface, but if you want this to double as a dining table, you can optionally add the dining tops to it as well. So you can just have it as your normal table and take the tops off and play games afterwards. And if you want chairs, they have those too that you could add to your order. And there's also ways to add the USB chargers around the table as well for everyone's phones. Now, if you're interested in all the costs of the standard table and, you know, the, the different options and such, there's a link in the description of this video that will bring you right to the spot. And there you will click the I want one button. And what's going to happen is because you have this link that I'm giving you, you're getting these tables 40% off with the first 100 backers getting them by the end of 2020, which is great. And, you know, the, the earlier you buy them, the earlier you'll get the tables. Now, when you click the I want button, you'll be putting in your name and your email address and phone number. You'll click submit and you'll get your coupon code immediately that you can basically put into the cart to see what the true price is after the great discount we have for you. But in case you're curious, the table itself without the dining top, all standardized with pretty much 
everything I've shown you here today, except for the custom graphics I've had, uh, is only $1,367.40. And it's free shipping, and this thing is big. That's a, an amazing deal. This makes this one of the most affordable game tables in the industry, if not the most. Now, full disclaimer here, if I've helped you learn about this table and you end up using this link to make a purchase, I will get a small commission, but it doesn't add any cost to you. In fact, using this link is the reason why you're getting 40% off, which is more than you can get anywhere else. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have more questions about the table, go ahead and put them in comments in the video below and I'll do the best to answer you. And if I don't know the answer, I'll help get the game theory tables folks involved to help answer your questions.